Alright, fire in the hole. I joined in August of 2003. Marine Staff Sergeant Jesse Cottle's world was forever changed in 2009. We were on an IED clearing, clearing mission and um, on foot. It's not the safest job no. you could choose. Jesse's job, to find and dismantle improvised explosive devices. You're looking at helmet cam video from that day in Afghanistan. Hey, Staff Sergeant Cottle. Yeah. Come check this out. About five hours into that patrol, into that mission, I uh, was struck by an anti-personnel IED. It was a pressure plate, so stepped on it, and um, they were, I lost both legs right away. The explosion was caught on camera. Ah! Ah! Go, 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 go! Oh, God! What do you need? What do you need? Oh. Tourniquets! Tourniquets! I remember most everything. I was awake the whole time. All right, get the litter out. Get the litter out. Hey, good. You're doing real good, all right? All right. Trust me, brother. You're in good shape. Okay. All right. It was tough, and, and it is tough in general, but um, I just kind of always had the attitude that, you know, it, it it's really tough now, but things will just be okay. And I had my family around me. I had good friends, and um, basically just my, my faith really helped me to carry through and um, I was lucky to be able to go through the tough recovery and then still live my life and meet my beautiful wife. He met Kelly during his recovery. She was swimming for Boise State at the time. I met her at a swim meet in San Diego. And I just remember being very intrigued by him. He was just very different and not just because of his legs, just who he was. You may kiss your bride. They were married in 2012. They live in San Diego now, but they're here in Idaho visiting Kelly's family. While they were here, they took family portraits. It was a normal photo shoot. It was just we finally all got together and Jesse had his legs on and everything. Photographer Sarah Ledford suggested a picture in the water. So we said, well, you could just pop your legs off and then get on one of our backs and we'll take you in. And so, because that's just how I. It's how we get around sometimes, like at the beach or wherever. Yeah, we do it all the time. It's just pretty normal. So um, he hopped back on my back, and then Sarah was like, oh, we'll take some couple shots. Ledford posted one of those shots, this one, on her Facebook page. She had no idea the image of Kelly carrying Jesse on her back would get the reaction it did. Overwhelming. Over, I can't even keep up with my page. Thousands of likes, hundreds of shares and comments. The picture just blew up. The, I mean, America just fell in love with Jesse and Kelly. God bless the both of you, and thank you tremendously for your sacrifice for our freedom. You are a hero. What's it like to see these comments, Jesse? It, again, just speechless. I, I, having that kind of impact, it's... it's it's very humbling. My yeah. first reaction was I wanted to just be able to reply to mm -hmm. each one, but then they kept. <laughs> kept I'm glad that that yeah, that it's we just can funny because it's yeah. that you don't expect it. Yeah, just, no, it's just kind of normal for normal, us, but it's yeah. cool because I think we represent a lot of people that are going through and a lot of couples that are going through the same thing, and so it's just. It's an honor to be able to represent that. Now, Jesse and his wife are an inspiration to thousands and a reminder of the sacrifices being made by our military every day. And that people actually care means a lot. Jesse and Kelly Cottle, Seven Zeros.